two roads diverged in a yellow wood. And sorry, I could not travel both. And being one traveler long, I stood and looked on one as far as I could to where it bent in the undergrowth. Then took the other, which was just as fair and perhaps having the better claim because it was grassy and wanted wear. I shall be telling this with a sigh, ages and ages hence, two roads diverged in a wood. And I, I took the one less travelled by, and that has made all the difference. The road not taken by Robert Frost sets the theme for our reflection on what Jesus says in the Gospel of today. Jesus is inviting those who are listening to him not to take the broad dough, but to take the narrow dough. Not to take that dough along which everyone would prefer to go, but to go by that dough along which few would go. And so the question is, what is the broad dough a metaphor for? What does Jesus mean when he says, do not take the broad dough? The broad dough is a dough in which my only concern is myself. The broad dough is a dough in which I only think about my needs and my wants and my comforts and my luxuries. The broad dough is a dough in which I do not spare any thought whatever for someone who does not have even the basic necessities of life. The broad dough is that dough in which I look at life as something to be enjoyed but privately, not in community, as an individual and not in a group. The narrow dough, on the other hand, is a dough of giving. The narrow door, on the other hand, is a door in which I say I have had enough and now it is time to share. The narrow door is that door when I realize that others in this world are as important as I am and if I can make life easier for another person, I must do that and I must reach out. The narrow door is not a dough of selfishness, but of selflessness. The narrow dough is not a dough of hate, but of love. The narrow dough is not a dough in which I will merely accumulate until I can accumulate no more, but a dough in which I will give and keep giving until it hurts. The narrow dough is a challenge, but it's an invitation. It is a dough along which the Lord himself has walked. It is a dough along which millions of selfless people have followed him. Will you follow the Lord on this narrow dough?